Hello lads, today is something a little bit different, but I'm really excited to get into, which is F1 Fantasy, and my god, I've been waiting to do this all season, because last year, I was a fucking idiot, and forgot to make a team, so, it's bad on me, but you know, I feel like I've got some good F1 knowledge, you know, I've been watching it my whole life, I know the history, so let's see how well I do, I mean, what am I fucking saying, history is going to have nothing to do with F1 Fantasy, but let's fucking go, first of all, Mazepin out, people are like, oh, it's so sad for him, just remember he's sexually assaulted someone, and then you don't feel bad for him again. But anyway, going into my first team, I'm really getting into this. I was contemplating what to go with. First of all, I was thinking Haas, because I was like, Haas are going to be better than last year, surely. But then, I think you're about to see, finally, I decided to go with Williams. Come on. It's the obvious choice for a low-paying team. If you don't want to pay for like a Mercedes or a Red Bull or even a Ferrari, Williams, they're going to be up. I, well, not up there. I really feel like they're going to be at least like fighting for 10th, maybe 9th. You know, like that area of the field. And I really hope it does happen. And then straight into it, boom, Magnussen. He's going to have a smashing year. Everyone loves Magnussen. Haas have got to do well, and for some decent, cheap players, Magnussen's going to be that guy who's getting up there and qualifying, you know what I mean? Like, remember how good his qualifiers were back in the day. And then Norris, M McLaren, going to have a fantastic year, so an obvious choice, and I feel like Daniel Ricciardo is a bit of a risk, so I'd rather go Norris. Signs, he beat Leclerc last year, let's see if he can keep it on. I feel like he will, but you may see later on that... I picked signs just because I didn't have enough money. But then Russell. Russell is definitely, definitely got to get in at least one of your three teams. He is going to be a star boy. He's up there for who I think is going to win the championship. I'm not even lying. He could be up there with the championship with Leclerc and Verstappen probably again. I don't think Hamilton's going to do it. I'm not going to lie. Really don't think he does. But yeah, anyway, you can see here, I'm looking at my choices trying to find someone cheap and then I end up going with Verstappen, Norris, Sainz, Magnussen, Russell and Williams and then Turbo Driver, I love this, two times the points, it's like on FPL, boom, you get extra points and I decided to go with Norris because not gonna lie, this first team I was a bit biased, uh, as you can see, um, <clears throat> it may be someone's favourite driver and favourite team since they were a little kid so um yeah <laughs> that's how it goes right and then now you can see i'm making a league feel free to join this league i doubt many people are going to join it it's only got 18 people subscribed to it so i'm not expecting many people probably just going to be myself for half of it but if something does happen feel free to join here's the code then going into this you can see there's so many like there's so many leagues you can pick from it's fucking insane like, oh, my cheeks trembling from the choice. I'm going to have FOMO from missing out. But basically, the main ones I go to is Formula 1 YouTube. And you'll see Formula 1 Twitter. And I'm trying to I'm trying to keep it to as little as possible. Because I don't want to over... Like, I don't want to be in too many leagues where it doesn't even matter anymore what the fuck I'm doing. You know what I mean? I want to be in a select amount. And that's what I'm aiming for there. Right, now on to my second team of the three. And... Now I'm going to try to spruce it up a little bit because, you know, fantasy, fantasy F1, it's all about doing well. But at the same time, you want to have fun. So you want to get the metas and stuff, but also you want to have a bit of fun. You know what I mean? And that's why I thought about doing McLaren, but I was like, nah, let's get real. Ferrari are going to be up top. Everyone has this feeling, and I'm really hoping that it does come true. So I've gone all out Ferrari on this team. Ferrari and Leclerc. Leclerc could really win the championship here, and I have so much faith in him to do it. Then onto Ricardo, which to me is a wild card. I had a shit year last year, but you never know what the fuck he can do. Because well, he got that first place last year, so he can pull anything out of the bag. He's the fucking Oni Badger. Right, then I put Latifi in, but you're going to see I change him very shortly. But then more onto Alonso. Come on, it's Alonso. You've got to have him at least one of your three teams. He is going to be meta, I'm telling you. Even if the Alpine is shit, he's going to drag that car occasionally into points paying positions. And for 12.5 mil, I feel like that's a bargain. Same with Perez. 17 mil for Perez is a fucking bargain. I doubt he's going to be very good. I feel like he's going to be coming like fifth and sixth most races. But, man... He's a top choice. 
but yeah as you can see turbocharger tur tur charger turbo driver is leclerc obvious choice there he really could win the championship here I'm telling you if that ferrari like lives up to his name <laughs> ferrari could smash everyone out of the park but anyway onto this now for this one i wanted a big big team i was not williams not ferrari i mean i say ferrari but that's the third highest paying team i would say ferrari is quite expensive so be careful on that because it is a risk at the end of the day because they didn't only come third last season right and as you're about to see i pick mclaren because they're not the top top paying cars but i feel like mercedes and red bull are going to be a ripoff they're too expensive i feel like especially just for one position and when you i feel like you're going to need drivers more and i feel like that's why hamilton if you have the funds go for him i feel like this my third team i feel like is probably my weakest because hamilton i don't think he's going to be doing well but latifi on the other hand i feel like he's gonna have a great year and i took him out of my other team to bring in alonso no vettel but Latifi, he's going to have a year, I'm telling you. And then I brought in Norris again because I was thinking, I was like, who can I bring in? And I didn't really know. And I love my boy Norris, so I'm going to pick him. And then I was like, Bottas. I hadn't brought Bottas in. And I was like, Bottas isn't a shit driver like everyone thinks he is. Yes, he didn't do, he did bad. In, he didn't actually do bad in Mercedes. He was just average driver in Mercedes. But he doesn't deserve as much hate as he gets. Yes, he didn't win a championship, but he's good. Then I went for Leclerc again and mclaren as the team and then turbo driver leclerc and as you can see i'm pretty happy with my teams please tell me if you think otherwise but i think my teams are pretty set like i don't think any of the joes the schumachers the ocon what well, i say ocon, ocon could be but i'm gonna say ocon the sonodas the only person i feel like i didn't pick who could fuck me over is gasly but i don't know i don't i'm not feeling the alpha Tauri this year i'm telling you but anyway, yeah, that about wraps it up. I hope you enjoyed. Um, please, please do do F1 Fantasy. It is so much fun to get more out of the races. You know, you've got more on the line. It's like it's like betting, but with no money. So you've got nothing to lose, but everything to gain. So yeah. Anyway, see you in a bit. Oh, and quickly before I go, wild cards are going to be massive this year. So be prepared to use wild card in like the second race because. Who the fuck knows where the order's going to be. And if I'm wrong about Ferrari or Williams, then I already know I've got to make big things, big changes to my team. So yeah, just adding that extra. But yeah, now I'm officially gone.